Hello everyone, in this video we are going to talk about how to upgrade Jenkins. First we can go to manage Jenkins section and we can see that Jenkins itself is displaying, it's complaining actually, about some plugins that need to be upgraded as well or uh, those are compatible with the new ver newer version which is this one. We are going to install the version 2.2. 235.5 my current version is this one 222.3 so there are a couple of ways to upgrade Jenkins one of them is by running sudo geom this flag update Jenkins this will automatically download the package and install it in the system but I will do it by downloading the WAR file as you can see in the bottom of the, of the page is listed the Jenkins.war for the newer version so I'm going to download this one and I'm going to install it by using this okay i'm going to pause the video and when the download is completed i will resume it okay it is completed so i'm going to my desktop and i'm going to list the jenkins warp this is it okay so to, to know where the, the current jar file exists, we need to go to manage Jenkins, which is the section that we're already in, and scroll down to system information. And here we have a, a section executable war, and this is a path. In my case, it's user lim Jenkins. So in the terminal, I'm going to list that one user lib Jenkins okay as you can see uh, this is the jar the, the, the war file for Jenkins and the permissions are different the the owner and the group are different so we need to make some changes the first thing we need to stop the service systemctl stop Jenkins okay we are stopping the application if we go back here it's nothing now okay then I'm going to back up my current war file in a different directory so I'm going to copy user leave Jenkins uh, user leave Jenkins and the Jenkins dot war file I'm going to copy it no not here I'm going to copy it in TMP okay if I list TMP Jenkins Oh, there are a lot okay we have the Jenkins war okay let me check the permissions for both so I'm going to change this ch own I'm going to change the ownership to root Oh, I need to do with sudo because I'm not the owner okay now we have this one and the permissions should, should change as well okay I'm going to update the permissions which sudo ch mode 644 for Jenkins war 
okay as you can see the the package that i'm having in my desktop has the same group the same owner and the same permissions that the one in user lib jenkins so i'm going to move it this one to user lib jenkins okay and i'm going to list this one okay we have the the latest one and i'm going to start the service now okay it will take a few seconds let me go back to the browser and i'm going to load it okay i will pause the video and resume when this process is up and running okay jenkins is back let me sign in the users should be the same so no changes on the credentials here is my dashboard also all my jobs remain the same and as you can see at the bottom this is the new version we have upgraded jenkins to the latest okay we go back to the manage jenkins section okay we can see the view is a bit different now it's not grouped as a list but a subgroup or subset um, by the which each organization method they decide system configuration here is security status information troubleshooting tools and actions uncategorized okay i'm interested to go to manage plugins because we may need to update some plugins okay okay i'm going to update okay i'm going to update the plugins that i usually use which is the api tokens credentials docker yeah email extension of course git github along with git api the unit matrix pipeline yeah pipeline declarative as well and groovy uh, here uh, declarative pipeline job rest api script security time server trail api okay i'm going to download and install after restart Okay, as you can see, it's installing and downloading the plugin that I've selected. And after that, I'm going to restart Jenkins. And I will pause the video and resume when every, every plugin is updated. Okay, Jenkins is back, so I'm going to sign in. Okay, go back to manage plugin section. This is uh, how we can upgrade Jenkins in a very easy way because we just replace a WAR file just with a simple MB command. And we have the new features, but you always remember to, to have a backup for the previous WAR in case something goes wrong with the newer version. So you can roll back immediately with almost zero downtime okay this is all for this video i hope you enjoy it please subscribe to the channel stay tuned thanks